Hello, everybody, and welcome. My name is Mr. B. You're in the Lincoln Center pop-up classroom, but this is not your ordinary Lincoln Center pop-up classroom. Why? Because it's Friday. <laughs> Today is Friday fun challenge. That's right. So every day, us teaching artists here at Lincoln Center pop-up classroom give you all a challenge. Maybe in music, art, dance, sculpting, photography, puppets, whatever it may be. And you rise to the challenge and you amaze us with your creativity and imagination. And some of you said, well, what about you all? Well, can we challenge you? And we said, why, yes, you may. So last week, I got the first challenge. I had to do uh, three characters in one scene under five minutes. And Ms. Deb presented your challenge to me. I had a great time. Thank you. And then we asked you all, well, what should be next? And you gave us some input. You said that, Ms. Deb. She's not only a, a fantastic dancer and teaching artist, she's dang funny. Let's put her in the challenge chair. And that is what we're going to do. But before she comes in the room, let me give you the skitty, the scoop. Now, Ms. Deb is a dancer extraordinaire. -ess. She is a professional. And I bet she probably knows every dance that's ever been invented since the history of dance. Well, maybe not all of them, but we're going to challenge her in that way. So we asked you, send in some names of some good dances. Just go ahead and make them up. And we're going to tell Ms. Deb they are from the official dance book. And if she's a true professional, she really should know how to do them. That's only fair, right? Trickery. Trickery and buffoonery. <laughs> So we're going to invite Ms. Deb into the room. My friend Curtis is going to bring Ms. Deb into the room, and we're going to tell her about her little challenge for today. <laughs> Hello, Mr. B. I am so excited for this challenge. I have no idea what's going to happen, but I've been stretching since 9 a.m., and I'm wearing my cat shirt, so I kind of feel like I'm ready. I'm ready for anything you throw at me. You are a true professional. I was just singing your praises. And now look at this. You're in the little square and I'm in the big square. See how this feels different from last week? <laughs> wow. So here's the deal. We reached out to our wonderful learners out there and said, you know, Miss Deb pretty much knows all the dances ever. So let's test that knowledge. Pretty much. I mean, you did write the book on dance. Well, I don't want to plug, but based on the hit movie, uh, Dirty Dancing, I don't know if you've read Deborah Dancing, <laughs> the book that you wrote. It's one of my favorites, and it holds <laughs> all the moves and all the keys. So I'll be consulting Deborah Dancing during this workshop. P.S. I so love yeah. the book cover. I I don't know if I've ever actually seen it. Wow, wow, that's amazing. <laughs> so here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna give you the name of a dance, and you're just mm -hmm. gonna have to model it. Now I've got oh. the book, so if, if the dance is on point, I'm gonna give you two thumbs up. And then you're going to okay. get your next dance. But I mean, Great. I just, you know, I don't want to disappoint our viewers. So if you're a little bit off, if there's something a little off, I'm going to give you the wait a second Great. and give you the correction. Is that okay? That's totally great. I want to make sure that I'm being as accurate as possible and that the information that I'm giving is truthful. So yes. From the book. From the book. Deborah From the book. Yeah, yeah. Now there. <laughs> All right. So how about this? Why don't we get, uh, we'll get a five minute clock up on the, the screen. We'll see uh, how many dances you can get right in five minutes. And maybe Curtis will okay. give you a little bit of music. All right. So for your first dance, and now this is a very easy one. We're all very, very familiar with this. It is the, uh, it's known as the sparkly. The sparkly swing. Okay. Yeah. All right. Jeffrey, you disappeared. Where did you go? No. I don't even see you in the corner. I, I, I think I'm doing this right. Okay, the sparkly swing. I mean, obviously, um, uh, the fingers are going to, you imagine you have little diamonds on the ends of your tips, and you swing them side to side. Now, you can start kind of easy and get bigger. <laughs> I love it. Excellent. Perfect. Okay. Oh, awesome. Okay, great. I'm ready for my next one. Okay. Oh, our next our timer just started. So that was a test one. Um, can you please show oh. me uh snake knees? Now this was popular during uh the 1930s, I believe. The sna uh, snake knees. Do you remember oh, snake, the snake knees? knees? Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, this is this was really popular back in the days of Hollywood. Uh you you imagine that your kneecaps are little snake heads and they kind of lead you around the dance floor. So uh, this is also a popular one to do seated as well. Uh, 
yeah, the knees just kind of lead the movement and the rest of the body follows like the snake. Oh, yes, Jeffrey? I, I just want to say, in the book, it does say it's a very formal dance. So I think you have to have, you have to wear something a little formal. Oh, I'm so sorry. You need fancy shoes for this one. Okay, so um, it changes it slightly. It only changes basically, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, all right, so yeah, with your sparkly shoes on, you're still gonna follow. The knees are still gonna take you around the room. It just might get a little smaller. Uh, maybe you utilize the arms a little bit more this time in the formal one. Um, yes, because you're wearing jewelry and you wanna make sure everybody can see all of it. And so okay. I'll okay. end with beautiful, I saw the formality. That was quite right. good. Remember right. the next one. Um, pajamin. Remember pajamin? That was all the rage? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ha, totally. Nice, excellent. And oh, weren't there, weren't there yeah. words? Uh, isn't there some kind of word, words that go with that? You say a certain oh, word? Oh, yeah. Yeah. So when you're doing a little circle with your arm before you punch it out, you go jam, in, jam, in. Some people like to just say the in, in. Some people like to just go jam, jam. Yeah. Okay. Great. Cool. All next. right. Now the next one, uh, you know, it requires a wig. So I don't know if you have a wig nearby, but it's the Tippa oh, Canoe. Uh, remember her? The silent film oh, star Tippa that was Canoe. a famous dance. Tippa Canoe. Okay. Yes. So she was a redhead. Um, I know. Um, <laughs> Tippa Canoe. Yeah. Okay. So just and what was her you're, you're pulled, you, um, you're, you're moving on the diagonal, like you're in a tiny canoe. And what's going to happen is actually, this is a, a move for only one leg. So you're going to try to balance as if you're floating in a canoe, but you're staying on the diagonal the entire time. And there are moments where you look, Okay, great. Super. That was beautiful. I love that dance. All right, so now you remember in the 80s when everybody sang that song, Feed the Bird, but then somebody was like, no, it's Feed That Bird. It's the specific, remember, Feed That Bird. What was that dance? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so Feed the Bird was like, you know, Feed the Birds was kind of like this general move. And then we got more specific, which I really, really love. So it's all about getting low, right? Because you need to be with the bird. You need to be directly near the bird. And it was like a little, like, come here. Come here, feed that bird. Come here, come here, feed that bird. Yeah? Yeah, feed, yeah, you're, you're, you, you, you draw it in. Okay, oh, a minute 30, right. give me more. Oh, oh, okay, oh, oh, the, the Technicolor smear. Now that one, there's a book in it. It says that you do something with a book. The Technicolor smear. Okay, um, let's see, my books. Okay, um, so, also, I know there's some lighting, I think, involved in this one. So I'm just going to um, do. Um, so the yeah, book, you're right. you start, and you, I, and let me show it from the side. You're going to rub it all the way down your face. <laughs> and then the you smear. hit your heart with it. So it's like you do this little surprise, and then you... Yes, yes, you've got it. I and it. I know that it's in other in other areas, people have, you know... They've worked it down on their body parts, but the original was down the face. Okay, 30 I'm seconds, I'm, I'm ready. Cool. Okay, the wind tunnel, quick, the wind tunnel. Oh, well that is just the a static tunnel. one. It's still, it's pretty still, and you're trying to see like, um, I'm sorry, I got to the end of it. It starts together, and it's a slow, slow, gradual experience where you win, you're fighting against it, you're fighting against it, but you're losing, and eventually, you lose. All right. Okay. Nine seconds. Give me one more. Second. The lockdown. The lockdown. Oh, yeah. That's it, and it just looks like this. <laughs> With tiny sparkle fingers. Tiny fingers. Tiny fingers. Oh. Woo. Yay. Wow. Yeah. That was so much fun, Mr. B. Uh, I feel so honored that you shared my uh, book with everybody and that I was able to share some of these amazing lesser known dances. I just feel like my Friday has been made. <laughs>
And also, I, we I know that we didn't, we didn't, <laughs> I know we didn't cover all of the moves. So I know if you out there watching have a move that I didn't cover, if you want to share that on Instagram and tag me, um, or just hashtag Lincoln Center at home, show me what the move is. I'll totally do it for you. Yeah. So uh, if anybody wants to offer up a dance move on Instagram, I see you. And um, yeah, send me more challenges. That was so much fun. <laughs> you succeeded. I must say that was fantastic. Thank you, Mr. B. Thank you, Lincoln Center Pop-Up Classroom. I had so much fun. Thank you for all those challenges. And we will see you next week when the challenges are back at you. <laughs> Where's it called? Yeah. Stretch. Technicolor smear. Oh, I'm doing the technicolor smear for you. <laughs> and feed that bird. I'm totally gonna go feed that bird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, so boy. incredible, everyone. So incredible. Right, bye, See everybody. you later, Mr. Thank you for playing. Thanks for your challenges. <laughs>